what I wanted to show you today was uh, just briefly I've opened up my crossover and accessed Steam and I have Steam running and then from Steam I'm just going to simply enter my password and access the main panel and this will let me access all my Microsoft Windows games in Steam through my Linux Linux desktop and it does a really good job you can see here now I don't have a lot of games my sons have tons but if I go into library and take a look I've installed uh, Call of Duty Black Ops and I used to play that with my sons multiplayer in the zombie mode and, and we still do every now and then and it's one of the few programs I go back to Windows for and I would say on this machine uh, given its specs it runs at about 85 percent there's just a little bit of lag when there's a lot of zombies on the screen and if we take a look at the stats for this machine you can see it's no screamer now one of the things yeah I'm running a quad core 2.2 gigahertz AMD Phenom and I have 8 gigs of RAM that's, that's more than enough and I have a decent card an Nvidia 660 and if you want to go this route I would highly recommend that you run Nvidia graphics cards because of their compatibility with uh, most Linux operating systems and also the quality of the graphics card is gonna really be the deciding factor on how well your games play once you get past four gigabytes of RAM so I, I would say you know you'd want probably a minimum of six gigabytes of RAM two for the system and four for the game and as good a NVIDIA card as you as you can get and one of the disappointments I had was I wanted to show you my Call of Duty zombie runs but every time I go into it it cuts out the screen recorder so unfortunately I can't show you and I'll have to uh, devise a system to show that to you in the future because I think it's interesting and there you have it that's crossover a very interesting free program that comes with deep and normally you'd pay 30 or 40 dollars for it and uh, the people at programmers at code weavers are just doing an excellent excellent job in supporting wine you can do the same thing through wine on a different computer and I've done it on a much stronger computers but with less graphics card driver support and the results have been less than stellar so the, I think the key really is to get a really really good proprietary driver for your card if you want to try and play Steam games through your Linux machine. Thanks for watching.